Automakers have made it clear electric vehicles are the future, but in order for that to happen, you need places to charge them. And that's what Kroger, DTE, and a company called Volta are trying to do. They are looking to bring charging stations to places that uh, don't have many at the moment. Priya Mann, live with more on this story. Just the first steps, though, right, Priya? Yeah, Devin, the first of many steps. That's what officials are hoping for. Let me show you what the charging station looks like with that big digital screen. It's outside of a Planet Fitness here at the Pistons Performance Center. Drivers we talked to say they welcome the development. If there were more charging stations, more people would have electric cars. I know I would. <laughs> Nicole Smiley wants to buy an electric vehicle, but says range anxiety is holding her back. It's easier to fill up a gas tank than it is to fill up an electric car. So again, if I'm out and about and get somewhere that I can't charge up, I'm in trouble. Nicole says she wants to see more charging stations like this one that's next to a Planet Fitness in New Center. They need to be everywhere we are. The EV revolution isn't a conversation about the future. It's it's here with grants from the state and rebates from DTE. Volta charging plans to build eight new charging stations in southeast Michigan and Volta chargers are unique because they're not just a refueling station. They're also a platform for education with these large digital screens targeting underserved communities. Charging stations will be built at Kroger locations in Southgate, Roseville, Westland and Lapeer. We can use technology in an intelligent way to solve issues of equitable access. Volta Charging says this type of infrastructure is critical to addressing the climate crisis and making it more attractive to go green. We're going to see more EVs roll off assembly lines. We're going to see more batteries being built. We're going to see more chargers being put in the ground increasingly here in Michigan. But that doesn't happen equally. And that's the key here. So it's all about location, location, location. Officials are targeting these EV charging stations in traditionally underserved communities. Uh, development is currently underway at these eight new charging sites, and officials are hoping to get this development underway soon. This, is, of course, is a part of the Whitmer administration's massive investment in green infrastructure. Reporting live in New Center, I'm Priya Mann, Local 4.